Hello, I'm James Harvey, the Professor of Music Theory at the College of Southern Nevada with 5-Minute Music Theory. Let's begin that timer, and we're going to talk in this video about the concept of double dotted notes. We have talked about regular dotted notes. There is such a thing as a double dotted note. Although it is rare, we do need to know what to do when we run across one. So what we're going to do first is solve the duration question of how long is a regular dotted half note, which we did in the other video, so we're going to go through this quickly, that we take step one is to mentally remove the dot, step two is to divide step one and half, and then step three we add these together. So this is all just applied to that first dot all of this stuff here. I'm going to draw a dotted line, unintended, and then add another dot to the next um, two, next to the dot that I already have on that half note. So now I have a double dotted half note there. And when we have a double dot, what we do is we attack each one of the dots individually. And we've already solved the first dot. There's another set of steps for the second dot, which we'll put down here. And not send second second dot so the first step for this second dot is find step two from above step two was the quarter note from above and that's the value that we added to the original undotted note so i'm going to put that in parentheses here so we we're pretty much taking whatever we added to that uh undotted note from before. And then we are finding half of that value. Find half the value of step one. Half of a quarter note is an eighth note. So there we go. And then the last step is we take step two and we add that. Add Step two to step three from above. So what we're doing is we're taking step three, which was a half note plus a quarter note, and then we're adding an eighth note to that. So the concept is once you put a dot on a note, you're slicing half the value off of the original note and adding it to that original note, just like we did with the half plus the quarter. And then we take the eighth and we add that, and that's the double dotted. So once we add that second dot, we have this extra eighth note. Now let's try to solve one more. We have just enough time to be able to do this, and I'm gonna have to quickly erase this stuff like that right here. Okay, let's take a double dotted whole note this time. Yes, there is such a thing as a double dotted whole note. So we figure out the value of that first dot by going through these steps. We remove the dot and then we find half of that whole note and that's a uh, half note. Therefore, a dotted whole note is like a regular whole note, whole note plus a half. And then we have the next step here, which is pretty much applying the same uh, concept or the same set of um, changes to the uh, first series of steps here. Uh, we find step two from above, half of that is a quarter. So step three is we take the original whole plus half and then we're adding a quarter note to it. So this is a little bit complicated once you get double dots, and we really don't run across them very often, but we do need to know what to do with them when we do run across them. So just save this video in the back of your mind, and if you can't remember how to do it, come back, check it out. It was less than five minutes, so it won't take too much time for you. So thank you very much. That is it on the concept of double dotted notes. You can reach me at my Twitter at 5 Min Music Theory, or just feel free to leave a comment, or don't, either way. Thank you very much.